Since its launch, Shiba Inu has been associated with a number of big tech companies in some way, and the latest in those associations happen to be Apple and Amazon. Both Apple and Amazon have had some kind of influence on Sheep's valuation in the crypto market in recent times, and in today's video, we'll be looking into how and why that is. There are a number of other interesting updates that we'll also be getting into, and you don't want to miss out on them, so be sure to stay tuned. Disclaimer Hey there, Sheep Army! Welcome back to the channel, and thanks for joining in for another video. If you're new to the channel, you're very welcome here. On this channel, we talk everything Shiba Inu and in the Shiba Inu ecosystem. So, if that's something that you're interested in, consider joining the family by subscribing to the channel and hitting the notification bell so that you never miss another video. Now, let's get on with the video. Today's video is a pretty interesting one with lots of important updates concerning Sheep's price action. But let's begin with Robinhood. The investment brokering app has revealed its earnings for quarter 1 2022, and they don't look great. Just released quarterly report shows Robinhood's revenue and active users on a decline, where its active monthly users were 17.7 million the previous year and 17.3 million the previous quarter. The quarter one report shows that they're now only 15.9 million. The average revenue per user is probably even worse. As of last year, Robinhood was recording $137 per user, but in the quarter before this, the amount fell to more than half of that at $64. And in the recent quarter, it fell even lower to $53. What's more, U Today records that overall net revenue fell 43% to $299 million compared to $522 million in the first quarter of 2021. According to the retail brokerage, crypto trading revenue fell 39% to $54 million, although it still outpaced the equities trading revenue of $36 million. A year ago, the figures for crypto and equities were $88 million and $133 million, respectively. This is obviously a really sad reality for Robinhood, but I should mention here that the quarter under review here is before she was listed on the platform. Now, I'm not saying that this listing was magical and must have somehow fixed everything, but isn't it possible that quarter two might be a bit better for Robinhood as a result of the listing? Especially considering that Robinhood's shares climbed briefly following the announcement. I'm not the only one who thinks this way though. There have actually been predictions that quarter two will be better for Robinhood as a result of their recent smart decisions, including listing SHIB and some other digital assets. The company also launched its crypto wallets into the waiting hands of about 2 million waitlisted customers. Robinhood also plans to integrate with Lightning Network, a layer two Bitcoin payment protocol to allow for faster transactions with lower fees. And then there's the fact that it signed an agreement to acquire Ziglu, a UK-based electronic money institution and crypto firm. This way, Robinhood has the opportunity to expand into the UK. All in all, it's probably safe to say that quarter two will be significantly better for Robinhood than quarter one. And a win for Robinhood is kind of a better win for Shiba Inu, basically because of the listing. That said, it's probably still too early to call. We'll just have to wait and see what the quarter brings. Now, let's get to the big news. Apple and Amazon have had a rather tough time in the stock market recently. Sadly, this negative sentiment experienced with tech stocks rubbed off a little on Shiba Inu. It looked like some investors got jittery when those big tech companies experienced a price dip and so decided to sell, causing Shiba to take a bit of a dip as well. Fortunately, Shiba Inu is already bouncing back as analysts predict an upcoming price consolidation. FX Street reports that Sheeb Price sees the Relative Strength Index flatlining as buyers and sellers are in equilibrium around current levels, which opens the door for a pop higher as the week ends and the dust can settle with investors ready to go long risk assets again. This prediction might have something to do with the fact that the Nasdaq did not drop that much regardless of the fact that big techs like Alphabet recorded a loss in the past week. Because this happened, investors seem a bit more willing to buy and hodl sheep tokens, which, analysts are saying, could lead to a price pump for the token. To corroborate what the analysts from FX Street predicted, a crypto community with 70% historical accuracy has predicted that Shiba Inu will delete a zero by May 31st. But before we get into that, this channel has a daily giveaway of 100,000 sheep. For a chance to participate in the giveaway, all you have to do is subscribe to this channel, like this video, and leave a comment below. Hashtag Shiba Inu. Good luck. The crypto community, which is at CoinMarketCap, has projected that Shiba will trade for an average of $0.00003167 by May 31st, 2022. And 23,782 votes determine this. 
If this happens, it would be a 39.52% increase in price for the token. Now, this might be a bit ambitious, but the crypto market can be really crazy sometimes. So who knows what tomorrow could bring? That said, all the external optimism must be somewhat satisfying for members of the community who are still quite optimistic about the token too. It is good to know that this isn't only members of the Shiba Inu community that are optimistic about the token. What's more, HODLer's optimism has been rewarded a number of times already. There was the one time that investors woke up to millions of dollars in their wallet and more recently when Sheep experienced a $1 billion inflow into its market cap, rewarding HODLers. Time will fail us to go into the details of how Sheep got to its current price, making millionaires along the way. But the bottom line is that optimism and patience have always been rewarded and they will continue to be. That said, this is not me telling you what to do with your tokens, do what you need to do. Just make sure that it's based on research that you've done. Moving on to the general crypto market. Whales have continued to hold on to Bitcoin despite the Bitcoin price dip. Bear in mind that Bitcoin's price has been quite unsteady since the beginning of this year. Bearishness has happened quite frequently for the token, but this has not dampened the fervor of Bitcoin holders. Unfortunately, a bearish run is not yet a thing in the past for Bitcoin. Recent predictions say that Bitcoin prices could actually drop further by 20% in the next few months. And interestingly, holders are still holding, especially the whales. In fact, the whales seem to be the most adamant when it comes to holding onto Bitcoin. Now, according to Marcus Satoriu, a UK-based digital asset broker, whales have a substantial impact on the market, and this is something we all know. But the way we can see this play out in this Bitcoin situation is with retail traders taking a cue from whales and deciding to continue hodling. All of that said, as sheep investors, we can also learn something from this. Extended price dips in the crypto market are pretty normal and are usually not a sign to panic. Neither does it mean that there is something wrong with a project. It's really just a part of the crypto market at this point. That said, please be reminded that this is not a financial advice channel. I've never given financial advice and will never do that. So please do not make any financial decisions solely based on the information you get from this video or any of my other videos. Finally, the Coinbase CEO has responded to insider trading allegations leveled against him. As you might have heard, there have been allegations that Coinbase employees have been using insider information to trade in the stock market. The allegations started on Twitter as a lot of things do. The Twitter post that kind of started it all reads, found an Ethereum address that bought hundreds and thousands of dollars worth of tokens exclusively featured in the Coinbase asset listing post about 24 hours before it was published, ROFL. Coinbase CEO Brian Armstrong has not exactly confirmed that any of his employees have been found guilty and received a disciplinary action in this regard. What he did say though was that there's always the possibility that someone inside Coinbase could, wittingly or unwittingly, leak information to outsiders engaging in illegal activity. We have zero tolerance for this and monitor for it, conducting investigations where appropriate with outside law firms. If these investigations find that any Coinbase employees somehow aided or abetted any nefarious activity, those employees are immediately terminated and referred to relevant authorities, potentially for criminal prosecution. This was reported by Cointelegraph. Whether this will lead to disciplinary actions or even criminal prosecution of employees is left to be seen. With that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like the video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video to as many people as possible. Let's get this news out there. If you're a true Shiba Inu fan, then you must check out this video.